Latte and I are going to demonstrate loose leash walking. So I have her on the elevated bed. I take the leash in my right hand. I have my treats in the left. I release her from the bed. I say break and we're off to go around the tree. Now when we went around this, I could tell she was a little distracted. So instead of a reward with a treat, I told her she could go sniff and check out that tree. I figured a lot of other dogs had checked it out. And then she checked right back in with me, which was great. And we continued our walk and I sent her back to the bed. I didn't want to go too far since that was a training walk for a loose leash. So now we're going to go and do it a little differently, a little harder going counterclockwise around the cone. So she's on the inside and that can be a little trickier because the dog may not realize you're turning into them versus, Oh, and there she goes. She's interested in going past that tree. So I helped bring her back a little bit and then back to the bed. So you're definitely gonna find when you're practicing your loose leash, there will be distractions along the way. Just start incorporating them as your rewards, like to go sniff or to go say hi, and that will help build value for you. Here I released her, she's now off leash, and we're going to practice capturing the cone. She's on the outside. She did that beautifully. Now I'm picking up the pace around this tree, hoping that my speed will help her go around it more quickly and pay more attention to me since I'm a little more fun than the smelly tree. I hope this is helpful. Thanks for watching.